MMA fans love action, violence, and nasty fights where blood is scattered all over the octagon. But this is nothing compared to some thrilling and jaw-dropping KOs. From Joaquin Buckley's KO over Impa Kasangane to Conor McGregor's 42nd KO over Donald Cowboy Cerrone, 2020 has been full of devastating as well as the fastest knockouts in the history of MMA. Here in this video, we will talk about some of the fastest knockouts in 2020. But before that, hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to get notifications from us. Conor McGregor versus Donald Cowboy Cerrone. Yet again, Conor McGregor tops the list of fastest knockouts in MMA history. With a current record of 22 and 5, the former champ champ rejoiced over having the fastest main event KO. During his fight against Donald Cowboy Cerrone in a welterweight bout on the 18th of January 2020 at UFC 246, he finished the fight via technical knockout just 40 seconds into the first round. Connor proved that he was still as good as he was before, if not better. Joaquin Buckley vs. Impa Kasangane 26-year-old Joaquin put his name in the race of Knockout of the Year 2020 when he finished his opponent, Impa Kasangane, in the second round. He spectacularly won the fight via spinning back kick after Kasangane caught one of his kicks. This KO not only earned him the performance of the night bonus, but the video went viral on the internet and became the UFC's most watched Instagram video ever with over 17.8 million views. Cody Garbrandt vs. Rafael Asuncao Former UFC Bantamweight champion Cody Garbrandt gloriously broke his three-fight losing streak after knocking out Rafael in the second round. During the co-main event on the 6th of June 2020 at UFC 250, Cody finished Rafael with a vicious right-hand strike, ending the fight at 4.59 of round two. This KO earned him performance of the night bonus. Sean O'Malley vs. Eddie Wineland Undefeated rising star Sean O'Malley delivered a knockout of the year worthy performance during his bout against Eddie Wineland. On the 6th of June 2020, Sean faced former WEC Bantamweight champion Eddie Wineland at UFC 250. O'Malley ended the fight in less than two minutes with a right hand strike and knocked Wineland down and out. The KO earned Sean the performance of the night bonus. Kevin Holland vs. Jacare Sousa Middleweight contender Kevin Holland earned his fifth victory of 2020 with a first round KO over Ronaldo Jacair Souza. On the 12th of December 2020, at UFC 256, Holland faced former Strike Force middleweight champion Ronaldo Souza and banged the Brazilian fighter with a right hand, following a few more strikes. Just like that, the fight was over at 145 of round one. The knockout earned Kevin the performance of the night bonus. What kind of videos would you like to watch next? Let us know in the comment section down below. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon to be notified of our future content.